The UK government is set to continue with its plans to update the structure of the energy industry in order to provide a better deal for struggling families in the current economic climate. With thousands of households at risk of falling into fuel poverty, which is categorised as being when people spend more than 10% of their take-home income on gas and electricity, as prices continue to climb, the news could be welcomed by those who are unable to cope financially. In a speech made on Wednesday, May the 8th, Her Majesty the Queen Elizabeth II confirmed the government will continue to develop new legislation to update energy infrastructure and improve the water industry. She explained, My government's legislative programme will continue to focus on building a stronger economy so that the United Kingdom can compete and succeed in the world. It will also work to promote a fairer society that rewards people who work hard. In addition, a bill will be introduced to reduce the burden of excessive regulation on businesses operating across the country, which is part of wider plans to drive growth in the dwindling economy. Her Majesty's comments were made after official figures highlighted that some households are forking out hundreds of pounds over the odds to heat and power their homes, something that's impacting those who are already stretched by the rising cost of living. The average household in the UK is currently forking out an extra £315 to power this property each year compared with the sum they were paying in 2010. Campaigners who are fighting to lower energy bills have argued that extortionate prices, which have seen dual payments increase to an annual price of £1,420, are forcing some individuals to make the decision of whether to turn on their heating or provide meals for their families. Make sure you're not paying too much for your energy. Compare gas and electricity prices now at energyhelpline.com or call 0800 074 0745.